Okay, Tonka Sunday. So, these guys are my oddballs. I ended up with some new stuff. And actually, the coolest piece I got is sitting over here with the oddball. It's a cool old piece. Ford. It says on the tires, I never can pronounce the name of these right. Anyway, guy brought it up to show me with that one, which I knew I was going to buy because I've already got mighty one and two on booms super cool old trucks real clean have one hook I thought I didn't have any hooks those are the first things to go to line in hooks so anyway on my odd stuff that's not odd that's buddy L that's Earl stuff I believe the tow, little tow truck is nylon super cool little unit um, Definitely, sorry about that guys, definitely glad to have it. Um, <laughs> gentlemen actually wouldn't mind having it back and I don't blame them. But uh, I apologize, this is going to be an unedit, going to be a shoot and go. Now, this in here has had me baffled. It even had the gentleman baffled that I bought it from. Hood goes up. Neat old piece. Anyway, I bought a couple things. I believe this one, this project, came from the same guy with that box. I can't remember. Um, I'm going to back off maybe and pause it for a minute, my little mighty dozer. Okay, we're back. So, my mighty dozer on a Tonka flatbed that probably was not meant for it. Kind of always a little joke. But what I'm thinking about doing, we'll set him down here for a minute. I was taking Mr. Flatbed, and I've seen a few people do this, and I've kind of been looking at it. I should have paused again. Okay, this is horrible. But I'm going to pause again for a second. Okay, so anyway, I'm envisioning the toy that Tonka didn't build, and probably a bunch of different people have been like, but I've done that. Tonka stuff is slotted together. If you look at the comparison on the wheels, I think that bed would work. They're all put together by slot and tab. So you can kind of swap some stuff around. Let's look at the bottom of the fire truck. See, it's got the slots in the right spot. perfectly right spot to take the fire truck body off this chassis and put the shorty cab back on it. I know you're all saying, why would you wreck a perfectly good fire truck? It's actually not bad. But anyway, the fire truck cab with an adjusted Sorry guys, it's a little tough to do that. Bed, you know, probably coming about there. And ta-da, I have a Tonka rollback. So how silly is that? Anyway, that's that's something I was thinking about doing. Um, otherwise, like I said, cream chevron up there. I swear to God, that's the same, same truck that was in town that I did not buy when I bought the orange one. I think the orange one come first. There's a tag on this one with the t with the thing. Um, definitely Diane. Man, I don't know. I can't remember. I so let let let's start. Do I got a pointer? I got a I got a sapphire representing in bad lighting. Uh, pointer, 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 pointer. Give me a pointer. How about it, bro? What's that? So this whole fixation started with Green Mighty. I was dinking around one day, and I've done it twice now. I was in the flea market, and I seen it, and I actually got the copper plate that's behind it at the same place, oddly. But I found that one, I think I give a very moderate $20 for it. There's a lot of these, like the dump trucks, the loaders, 
those are all twenty dollar trucks some son of a guns are everywhere everybody had one so anyway i bought that i give like 20 bucks for it i was at a flea market somewhere else the finger works better and we picked up the little red dune jeep dune buggy jeep i give 20 25 buck for that was tickled because it was probably the next nicest one i had and at the time i had all the typical i probably had a bunch of those odd ones so with the green one when i got it i was driving for a different company and i went to my boss i'm like yeah man i drove a tow truck or bought a tow truck over the weekend and got them all spun up and then showed him the picture and i actually did the same thing this time when we got the cream one cream one and a little red <laughs> told my boss i was like hey boss lady i got some new some new uh tow, tow equipment to play tow trucks with or play tow truck with as i put it a uh, cool guy i don't know where eldon's at these days used to always that was his phrase let's go play tow truck so anyway green one come first red one comes second where i really started getting into it i bought the orange one i think offline one of these might have come from the old boy on the north end of town. Maybe the blue one come first. I cannot remember. Um, dude on the north end of town, he was doing kind of some odd stuff like that where he was sacrificing one to do one that hadn't been done. Um, I picked up this, this, actually the red one in the trailer for Dirty Cheap. Again, I had like a $20, $20 rule for a long time. <clears throat> While I love them, I would not pay more than twenty dollars for a Tonk toy. They, you know, I come up with them. My bless my brother's heart. He used to. He, he was the one to give me my like first mighty dump and my loader. Pretty sure at some point he had got me a dozer. Um. So, I want to say this one, which was really funny. I bought it in a group. I got it and like a, a, maybe a dump truck and most of whatever it was was beaten i give like 20 bucks for a whole lot but he said when he got that truck it was shiny it was nice so a little side note on on cream cream chevron and the baja truck if you'll notice they got these little turning turning deals in the middle of them when these came new and actually i think that truck's supposed to have a roll bar too something like this smaller one anyway when it came new they had a lug wrench that went with the little in a jack and uh, the 24-hour service truck it's set up the same way got a cutie truck in there something come off the store shelf the girls got me uh, so anyway um, I think I picked that up out in the flea market at Kingman little gold truck and I bought a bunch of stuff down off of uh, I think it's Whipple Street or no not Whipple um, Montezuma the Emporium if you're into high-end toys there's a guy down there further down the block's got crazy prices but he's never open but he's got super cool old old stuff so let's see eight minutes worth of Tonka is that enough um, yeah probably i can't think of too much more to say it's cool because i'm actually looking for some more of the proper small wheeled uh stuff that's a military jeep in the back it's a little blue one they're basically the same thing as as these guys on top just a smaller tire like actually those front ones those are too big but uh and actually for a while that one was my next nicest one because the glass was all good it, it wasn't too 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 beat up but yeah that cream one that, that top row ain't too bad that's uh three really really nice examples of uh tonka tonka record trucks and because of course i like towing and and things and when i was a kid i had a lot of cool tonkas my brother like i said he used to get them for me um these days i'm getting them because like I, I didn't even know that them existed for the longest time. I didn't, for some reason, which I'm surprised my brother didn't because he drove some. I'm surprised he didn't get me a wrecker. But uh, 
yeah i didn't even know if some of these existed like the jeep the doom buggy there's a bunch of variations on that back in the day tonka tonka had it covered man i mean there's that mighty dozer you know that ain't that toy ain't no joke you can take that out in the in the sandbox or the dirt in the backyard and push dirt with it as a little kid so yeah like i said i'm i'm thinking about it i might very carefully take them apart and see uh see if that isn't feasible to build a uh a rollback would really be badass if i make it take and steal a dump truck mechanism <laughs> i've been thinking about this because let's go out the out the out the and we'll close this video out with the sad pile i've got a barbie jeep up there uh i think that one come from the same place as the one that was really pummeled the pickup um i mean there's stuff tossed up on the top and then you get down here now sadly a couple of these fell off the shelf but most of them see i could take like this dump truck mechanism and made it with that bed and i bet you uh i have it set up so actually this mighty and i might even make the boy watch it so he gets a little sad this mighty that grader which was moderately nice and that loader i give to my favorite young young youngin who never would have you know he's six he don't know nothing about tonkas trying to explain to him that a lot of these toys are you know that cat there i'm pretty sure that's as old as i am which that dates the shit out of me uh but like i mean i, I yeah quite a while back you know some of these toys have really really been around like the uh, oddballs i threw out the fact that that sucker exists and in that good of shape if anybody out there can comment on it did this truck originally come with the tailgate it has a spot for a tailgate but there is no tailgate and i'm already over my video time so i guess i'm going to do one of these numbers hi guys you can see me in my winter finest bald as shit blind as shit can't hear shit and getting bearded we're probably gonna throw some blue in a minute anyway my newest tonka toys y'all we'll see you down the road thank you for taking a look